So, I want to say happy, happy birthday to my son, Brandon. I do it in advance. Just in case I don't get to make a video tomorrow, please God. Son, I love you very, very much. Happy birthday to you. 23 years old, people. All right. Brandon, continue to be the great young man that you are. All right. I know that I love you and that I'm here for your son. All right. So, it's coming from me and my entire family, your mom, Danielle, everybody. Right? Big up yourself. Big up your whole, whole self. So, good morning. Big up to all the people in Cardi Pichaima. All right, so with me is Miguel Betty. All right, and we heading down to the temple in the sea. So big up all yourself, big up all your whole whole self. Flip camera. All right, so we are in the beautiful village of Karipi Chaima. Right, nice cloudy skies, and we heading down to the temple in the sea. So let's go, guys. Field tech, I'm missing our driver boy. So, guys, I thought. That Miss Betty was going to be shy, but after all, she does not mind at all. So I am going to introduce you all. Here is Betty. Hey guys, yes. how are you doing? Good, and here's Larry. <laughs> Alright, so we come down to the temple in the sea, and it's the first time that she's been here and she's loving it. Beautiful. Very, very peaceful. Yes. So guys, we are actually on the west coast of Trinidad. This is Temple in the Sea. We'll get some more information as we move along. And what you are looking at here right now is the Gulf of Paria. In the distance is the western side of the Northern Range. On If the day was a bit clearer, we would have seen Port of Spain really, really good. Betty! What are the fellas doing here? For those of you who don't know, this is a ratchet tree. Other the Rastas use it for their dreadlocks.
I hope that so far I've captured enough that you can get the feeling like if you're right here with me right now I am noticing just like the last time you were here that the gates are closed but nevertheless let's focus on it a bit morning Okay, so you might not be able to read it, so I will read it. In honor of the Indian indentured laborers whose arrival in Trinidad and Tobago began on the 30th of May 1845 in recognition of their pioneering spirit, sacrifice, endurance, and determination to seek better livelihoods for themselves and their descendants. In gratitude for their invaluable contribution to the social, spiritual, cultural, economic, and political development of Trinidad and Tobago dedicated on the 30th of May 2014, the Global Organization of the People of Indian Origin and the Indian High Commissioner to Trinidad and Tobago. And there's a statue to the front, which I missed on the way in. So we're heading over to the statue. Obviously, it's the man himself who started this work the temple in the sea. Let's see how much information we could gather. All right, so let me read, guys. This is the memorial to Sudas Sadhu, unveiled by His Excellency, the President of the Republic of Trinidad and Tobago, Mr. Noor M. Hassan Ali, on the occasion of the 105th anniversary of Indian arrival day to Trinidad and Tobago, May the 30th, 1845, to May the 30th of 1995. And there's a lovely quote here, where there is unity, there is blessedness. Where there is this unity, there is wretchedness. On the occasion of the 500th anniversary of the Holy Ramayan of Tulsi Das, May 1997. And guys, there's a cemetery. All right, this is the parking area. So, temple over on that side, and cemetery over on this side. And I am seeing that there's also a cremation site down here. I could actually see there's actually a pyre there in the distance. I don't want to go in there as such. All right, um. Let's see what we could pick up from on this side here. All right, you see those two tents over there? They are actually pyres. There's a pyre underneath each tent. So, my sympathies to the family of seeing two pyres, so somebody lost a loved one so my sympathies to these people right so this is actually the waterloo cremation site and i am going to take in some of the vibes here this is very peaceful very very peaceful
all right so guys if you have never seen a pyre this is what it looks like i must say it really is a work of art right so see that little space there just the right size to be able to slip the coffin into I could smell the lumber in total from what I'm seeing here five funerals could take place here all at once five cremations from where I'm standing here you could see a lot of vessels out at sea waiting to go into point up here or even into the Claxton Bay area or Phoenix Park And I could hear the sound of the hearse coming in. So, let me be courteous and let me leave here. So, I hope you enjoyed this little video. Short and sweet. As I say, you never could tell where the adventure may go. So, everybody have a safe weekend. I'm really in too sure. If I'm going to do that live tomorrow night, guys, I just resting up myself and I will be back out in a bang if God spare life on Monday. And guys, there's a beautiful lady here selling some treats. What's your name? Latchman. Latchman. Nice to meet you. You're always here. Yeah. Monday to Friday. Every day. Every day. Once to have cremation. Once to have cremation. All right. And there's nuts. There's sugar cake. What do they call that? Gulab jamun. Gulab jamun. Cake. Egg cake. Chana. Chana. Snacks. Apple. Pepper sauce. Anchor. <laughs> Cold drinks. Aloo pies. Yes, All right, so come and support this lady, people. Yeah, All right, all the best.